This is an app making $40,000 every single month. And I'm about to show you how I recreated it without having to write a single line of code. So this is Quit. It's a quit smoking app that helps users track their progress, calculate how much money they've saved, and stay motivated through their journey to become smoke free. And the app uses gamification and health tracking to make quitting smoking both engaging and rewarding. And check out this screenshot. Here you can see proof of exactly how much revenue the original app is generating. Now most people think that you need years of coding experience to build something like this. But what if I told you there is one AI tool that can completely recreate this entire app for you? And today I'm going to show you exactly that, the exact step-by-step -step process that I used to copy this $40,000 per month app using only AI, no coding required. I recreated all of their core features, I connected it with Stripe for paid subscriptions, and I'm gonna walk you through every single step so that by the end of this video, you are going to know exactly how to use the best AI coding tool available right now to build your own version of profitable apps, even if you've never written code in your life. So let's go ahead and dive in. Now the AI tool that will build the entire app for us today is Base44. They're one of the best AI app builders right at this moment, and I added a special link in the description below so you can go ahead and check it out for yourself too. When someone decides to quit smoking, tracking progress can really make all the difference. Seeing the days add up, that streak going, the money staying in your pocket, and of course the health you're gaining back turns the journey into something real and motivating. So in order to bring this idea to life, we're going to use Base44. It's an all-in-one AI platform that can build fully functioning apps without any coding required. Now, all we need to do is describe the app in plain English, and then within minutes, we'll get a working version ready to go. Okay, so for this first build, the focus is on a dashboard that highlights the value of every single day. Now, here's the exact prompt we're gonna drop into Base44 create a responsive mobile first app called quit smoking for good at a top navigation bar with the app name and a menu icon below it create a user dashboard showing the following metrics days without smoking money saved cigarettes not smoked and life expectancy gain each card should automatically update based on the user's logged progress and time elapsed First things first, important disclaimer here as building apps and making money online is not an easy thing to do, despite what other YouTubers might be saying, all those copycats. Now, when I show you how to build an app, I'm demonstrating the technical process and the potential I am not guaranteeing your results. Now, these AI tools, they're legitimate, and as you'll see, the techniques do work, but success, as with all things in life, depends on our execution, our timing, and honestly, some luck. Now, most apps don't make money right away, and many don't even make money at all. So, I'm not promising that you're gonna get rich or that you should quit your job. Don't do that. This is not financial advice or a get rich quick scheme. I'm just showing you what's possible with these tools and what you do with that knowledge is entirely up to you. All right, with those expectations set, let's continue to building in base 44. And you see it spins up into a mobile first interface that puts progress front and center. Four dynamic cards track days without smoking, how much money we've saved, cigarettes not smoked, and life expectancy gain. And they're all updating automatically as time passes or as logs are added into it. And each one reflects actual behavior change too, turning small choices into visible wins. Now the counters stay fully dynamic, updating automatically with actions like daily logins and diary entries, or simply as more time passes since the quit date. Now the truth is milestones make big challenges feel a lot more manageable. So when someone can see progress broken down into smaller and smaller steps, a single day, a full week, or even a month, the journey does feel a lot less overwhelming and a lot more rewarding. So by layering in achievements and progression, doing that turns quitting into a path filled with constant wins instead of like one distant finish line. And to accomplish that, we'll work with this prompt in Base44. Add a milestone and achievement tracking system. 
display visual badges or trophies when users hit specific goals, such as one day, three days, one week, and one month smoke free. Include a level progression mechanic that increases as users maintain their quit streak and log daily activity. Show current level, XP progress, and the next milestone to unlock. So the great thing is everything is already built in for us. The database, the authentication, the email system, the analytics, and file storage. So all these progression mechanics work right out of the box with no extra setup coming from us. Now that foundation is what lets the builder roll out a gamified system layered on top of the dashboard where our users can unlock badges or trophies as they hit key streaks like one day, three days, one week, or a full month and at the same time a level progression mechanic that also tracks their streak and activity, displays the current level, their XP progress, and the next milestone on deck. So it turns the quitting journey into something that's truly engaging. Every login feels rewarding, and each milestone gives another push forward. However, quitting isn't just about counting the number of days, nope, it's about unlearning habits and finding new ways to handle the cravings and triggers that keep some people hooked. A structured program does help break the cycle by giving our users daily lessons, practical strategies, and progress they can see. With real content instead of just placeholders, the app shifts from being just a tracker to being a genuine, quiet companion. So let's make that happen with this prompt. Implement a structured smoking cessation program based on cognitive behavior therapy and who approved methodology. Break the program into daily lessons or tasks with progress tracking and locking and unlocking logic. Tailor guidance based on user input from onboarding questions such as their smoking frequency, quit motivation, and personal triggers. And with that, to make sure it's not just a placeholders, we will add a follow-up prompt like this. Add actual readable lessons and modules, not just placeholder cards. Include real lesson content like titles, short explanations, and actionable strategies for quitting. Now with those prompts, the builder generates a modular program based on CBT methods. And this feature represents the centerpiece of the therapeutic approach. Cognitive behavioral therapy has been shown to significantly improve smoking cessation outcomes. The program must remain modular, progress-driven, and personalized to user input. Now, our follow-up prompt also made sure that the modules contain actual lessons and strategies rather than just placeholder screens. Tracking progress isn't just about the good days. It's also about being honest when things do get tough and things will get tough. And having said that, we will be needing a diary that gives our users a space to check in daily, to track their moods, to really see those patterns behind the cravings. Stress, boredom, or maybe even social pressure, each log tells part of the story and even relapses become useful data instead of just a setbacks. So, all right, let's go ahead and send this to Base44 to make all of that happen. Create a daily diary feature with mood tracking. Allow users to log their cravings with categories like stress, boredom, or social situations, and whether they smoked or resisted the urge. Include the ability to log relapses with optional notes, timestamps, generate visual graphs, or trend summaries to help users identify when and why the cravings occur. So the beauty in this is that all of this does come together instantly because Base44 eliminates integration hell where competitors would have you wiring up separate tools for logs and graphs and storage, the list goes on. Base44 sets up a diary system that feels both personal and practical. Now here, users can jot down their mood, they can track cravings, and even admit when they slip without feeling judged. Relapse entries include timestamps and quick notes, making it easy to look back and spot those patterns. And over time, those logs can be turned into graphs and summaries that show when cravings hit the hardest and what triggers them the most. Now, this feature plays a key role in behavioral analysis. 
It allows users to identify their triggers and observe emotional patterns tied to their smoking. The recorded mood data and relapse entries also provide valuable input for refining and personalizing the CBT modules. For a lot of people, quitting cold turkey isn't realistic, and that's totally okay. Nicotine replacement therapies like patches and gums or vapes can make the process smoother, but only if they're used in a structured way. Having a tracker inside the app takes out all the guesswork and helps our users actually see how they're tapering off over time. So here's the exact prompt we're gonna hand over to Base44. Add a panel to track nicotine replacement therapy usage. Let users log their use of gums, patches, vapes, or e-cigarettes along with dosage or quantity. Provide graphs to show usage trends over time and allow users to set goals for a gradual reduction. Include optional reminders to log or reduce NRT use. And with that, Base44 responds with a panel designed for easy logging and reflection. Our users can now note down every gum, every patch or vape session with quantities and then watch graphs map out their usage over time. Goals for cutting back are baked right in, so it's clear when progress is being made. And this feature takes all of the guesswork out of nicotine replacement, because instead of just hoping they're cutting back, users can track their NRT use, they can set goals and see real progress. It's designed to encourage responsible use and then guide them step by step towards nicotine freedom. Quitting is tough on its own, but not knowing what your body is going through does make it even harder. And that's why having a place to read up on recovery, addiction, and real strategies can give our users the extra clarity they might need. An educational hub inside the app makes knowledge a part of our toolkit, right alongside progress tracking and lessons. So here's the exact prompt we'll hand over to Base44 to make that happen. Create an article library filled with expert written content related to smoking cessation. Include categories like quitting tips, health recovery timelines, and understanding addiction and withdrawal management. Allow users to search, filter by category, and bookmark articles for later reading. And as you can see right away, Base44 delivers a library that feels like a proper knowledge hub. Articles are organized into clear categories, and our users can search or filter to find exactly what they need. But here, we are encountering an error. So let's iron out the experience with a follow-up prompt like this. Fix article display. Currently, clicking an article opens up a white screen. Instead of redirecting, open article content inside a modal or card overlay with readable text. Now that does fix the error. Not only that, bookmarking also makes it easy to save something for later, while the fixed article view opens content cleanly in an overlay instead of sending users off to a blank page. Now this basically makes the app a go-to library. Our users can now read up on addiction, they can get clear explanations of withdrawal, and pick up practical quitting tips. Now it works alongside the CBT lessons by adding passive learning that boosts motivation and then lowers the chance of relapses. Now that our app is super packed with good functional tools, lessons, and a full knowledge hub, we need to find a way to, of course, sustain it. And that means adding a monetization feature. Monetization doesn't have to feel like a barrier. It can actually make the app stronger. Some users will definitely be ready for more, and adding a premium layer not only unlocks those extras, but also creates a sustainable way to keep the app growing while keeping the essentials free for everyone else. So let's tell Base44 to integrate Stripe Checkout for a premium upgrade, unlock features such as access to advanced CBT modules, detailed relapse prevention plans, downloadable progress reports and ad removal. Show the user's current subscription status and billing information using Stripe test mode for testing and development. 
And with that, Base44, as you can see here, responds by wiring Stripe Checkout for us directly into our app, connecting payment logic to premium-only features. And because Base44 comes with built-in top-level security, using standard encryption and reliable user login systems, both payments and user accounts are fully protected. Our users can check their billing details and subscription status in just one place, while upgraded accounts instantly unlock things like advanced CBT modules and progress reports. The test mode also keeps everything safe during development, and toggle logic, all of that makes sure our premium sections stay hidden until they're activated. And the end result is a clean upgrade path that works like a natural extension of the app, giving long-term users a lot more depth without taking anything away from the free experience. There it is, every single feature of the $40,000 a month quit smoking app rebuilt step by step with nothing but base 44. Thank you for watching and spending your time with me today. I look forward to seeing you at the next one.